Uh, you have protesters outside. Okay. Uh, it's obviously going to be something that the people okay. counting have to worry about when they go home. Take it. What do you have? Well, okay, so we are just being told that this building is now going to close. So we are the last news organization allowed to do a live shot here. Um, I, I want to start here because this is what it's about. This is American democracy. What you are seeing here are the good people of the Maricopa County Elections Department doing the count. This is the tedious at times, long, hard work of counting the ballots, making sure the information is correct. I'm going to swing you over this way. Uh, this is my producer, Kim Berryman. She's talking about how we're going to get out of this building. There is an exit plan being formed because what's happening beyond those doors right there, you can see that that is closed up, that shade has been dropped, is that outside there is a very sizable protest. Um, if you look at the aerial pictures from our affiliate, it's very big. This is a small parking lot. This protest has been going on for some time now. It is fluctuated in time, but it is sizable, as you can see. Um, the other we're concern sure people here, are here young, just so you know, yeah, uh, we're sure what's team. going on. And that's what I want okay. you to talk about, is how do the people who are doing the job feel about what awaits them outside? And how is it affecting what they're doing? I mean, okay, so let's, let's, let's start here. I mean, these people parked in that parking lot. Mm -hmm. How are they going to get, get the cars out of there? That, that number one, when they, when they finish this count, because we are expecting a count in about 20 minutes, a, 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 a look at what's happening to the ballots here, what could help figure out where the 11 electoral votes are going to go. So they're here for a while. We don't know how they're going to leave. We frankly, as we look at some of the officers heading out that way to try to figure out what to do as law enforcement with this large crowd, and I should add that this is a crowd that is armed. There are a number of people out there who have been seen with long guns, with automatic, uh, semi-automatic rifles, because this is an open carry state. So uh, there are a lot of security concerns. Plus, so, so Kyung, are, are they leaving? Are um, they, are they, uh, Kyung, are they leaving now because of the risk, or is it closing time? And what does it mean about beginning the count again tomorrow from that location? From what I can sort of piece together, because this was happening in the very uh, you know few moments right before uh, I joined you here, um, this this work is going to continue. The at, at uh, you know again 20 minutes from now, we are expecting the numbers to be released on time via press release, and everything is running smoothly on that end. The the work here isn't stopping. There are no problems inside. The problems are happening outside, and just trying to keep things under control so that this work can continue. What's the beef for the people outside? What is their message? You know, there's a lot of chanting. Um, a lot of slogans that we've heard before. Um, they're talking about count the vote, stop the vote, you know, that, that they want Trump. Uh, a lot of flags being waved, Trump flags. Um, you, you know, it's it, we, we heard uh, people singing YMCA for a little while. So it's just a number of different songs and slogans All right. as, uh, as this keeps continuing. All right, La last thing, and then you gotta find your way out of there and I'll talk to you from some other location if you want or you just call in and give us the information. But how do we get the information from the Arizona uh, state officials tonight if it's not gonna come from you in that building? Uh, we are told that they will get it to us somehow via press release. Okay. And so that'll probably happen electronically. As soon as we get it, okay. we're gonna bring it to you. All right, good. Safety first, uh, I hate that that's an issue right now, to be honest. Uh, you know, it's not like you're in a situation where it's supposed to be high tension. Yep. This is supposed to be democracy in action. Take care of yourself and the team. Send our best. I'll talk to you when you get out. Kyung, thank you very much. I got to tell you.